Hey guys, it's Emily. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Sinbono drawstring handbag. It's so cute. I have to show you guys. This video is also sponsored by Sinbono. I also just want to thank you guys for giving me the opportunity to have like these amazing, cool sponsorships, collaborations and stuff. It's all thanks to you guys and my viewers. Thank you so much. Although this video is sponsored, these are 100% my true opinions and feelings on this bag. If I don't like something, I will definitely tell you guys. So this is 100% honest. All right, starting off with the box. We have a cute little white and gold marble box, except it did come damaged so if you're a box person or you plan on keeping your bag in boxes just know it might come damaged but besides that keep box so when we open it oh it's backwards so when we open it we have it in a cute little dust bag let's take it out all right and here it is it's so cute if you guys didn't know, these bags are 100% vegan and cruelty free, which is honestly amazing because I don't believe in like killing animals for leather. So the fact that this is vegan is honestly just great. All right, so the first thing I do notice is some of the dust bag did stick to the bag, but you know, it's literally not that big of a deal. Just pluck it off. <laughs> it also is probably just because Canada was in a huge heat wave. So things just like stuck to it. But besides that, nothing big. All right, so this is the first look at the bag. This is in the ivory color. I absolutely love ivory colors. They look so good with like anything. All right, so we're just gonna open it like this. Oh, cute. And then I'm guessing these come out. Okay, and then since it's drawstring, you can just open it like this. And then it comes with a handle, I think this is. Handle? And then we have these two little silica gel things that we just can throw away. All right, so I think I'm going to attach the strap. I just wanna see what it will look like on. I don't know how to do it though. I figured it out, this just clips, and then you know, you can just drag it through like that. Okay, cute, so this is what it looks like, and then you can just open it. Wow, wait, I like it, it's very cute. And then you can just like close up the drawstring like this, and then you got yourself a cute little scrunchy drawstring bag. Ooh, wait, how does this look on? Oh, cute. <laughs> So the main thing I see with this bag first off is it just smells like plastic. Um, it just has like a plasticky smell, but it, I think that's like with every new bag you get. Um, the smell always wears off after like a couple uses. But I do want to see what fits all inside of here. So we're just going to open this up and shove a ton of things in it. <laughs> so this is my current bag right now. If you can't tell, I have a thing for ivory colored things. But anyways, my wallet is in here. All right, so this is the Simbono bag. So we're going to put in my wallet. It's just a average size mini wallet kind of thing. Fits perfectly. Next thing I always keep with me is my phone. It fits. Because of COVID, we got hand sanitizer and a mask. So far, we're doing very well. Next up is AirPods. Chapstick. And lastly, I want to see if I can put my glasses case in here. <laughs> Update, it all fits, but it is kind of a tight squeeze, but you know, it, it does fit. So it definitely does fit everything that I have inside my other purse and it all fits great. And it looks cute too. <laughs> I just took everything out. So along the inside, it's like this nice little um, material. It's just, it's soft. It also has an interior pocket right here. So you can throw your phone in there or like a mask or hand sanitizer or anything like that. It will fit. And then on the other side, you have another pocket and it just has the word Simbono on it, their label. So yeah, very clean and cute. I will say if you're constantly like fidgeting around in the bag, the inside stuff does come out pretty easily. But if you're like a normal person and not me, you'll probably be fine. <laughs> Besides that, the gold hardware is very nice. The bag literally feels good quality and I feel like I can just clean it off with a Lysol wipe if I ever have to and it'll be fine. It'll hold up over time. Anyways, I actually really do like this bag. The only main problem I had with it was the cotton stuff sticking to it at the very beginning, but it does come off. And like I already said before, it was just the smell. It does smell like plastic. It's a new bag. That's that's normal. But anyways, besides that, it will go away with time. If you guys want to see me open this next one, it's a very cute bag. It's called the Ella bag. Then definitely check out my Instagram. I'll be doing a whole little reel on there and you guys can see a cute little aesthetic unboxing video. <laughs> anyways, this is my Sinbono drawstring handbag review video. I absolutely really like it. And I definitely will be using this in all of my photos and just taking around town. It's so cute. <laughs> If you guys want to get yourself a bag, they have a ton on the website to choose from. They're all so cute. Then I highly recommend it. Everything will be listed down below. Their website, links, everything like that. It will all be down below for you guys. But thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!